Right, can you tell me what today's project is, uh, Andrew? I see you've taken away the the panel that's holding the um, uh, instrument. It's a sim simple enough job, really. It's not wiring this time, too much anyway. Um, this panel, this wooden front, that's holding all the, the radio, microphone, 12 volt panel, is all fine, but there are four screws that go into four wooden battens behind, over there. And each time, if you want to see anything, and as, as all the electronics have got more wiring's got more and more complicated, and trying to do anything, this is painful, it's not in a hinge, it gets caught in there, so it cannot actually, in the size that it is, fold out at all. It's really awkward. I've got to drop it down, pull it out, not at all very clever. So my idea is that I'll take, so that the whole panel can, the whole unit can drop down, I'll take a piece of, a strip of wood out of here. That's the bottom, bottom of that panel. Yes. Move that bottom up, that strip up there, so that that now comes down to match up with those, and then it will fold in and out. Um, and I've got a hinge. Is that a special hinge? What, stainless, hinge? Piano, uh, it's called piano hinge, stainless steel, stainless steel screws for marine use um, and I will make space for it, oh, screw it on in this new bit that I've cut off the bottom. I'm just taking the uh, VHF splitter off so that it's out of the way when I'm sawing. Right. Other than that, we're good so to go. That's the cut now made. From down here. So that strip along down here. It's now moved up there. Nothing's actually been hinged yet. Now, what um, what saw did you? Because you were, it's quite difficult with all these connections. It's a multi tool. I couldn't pull the cabinet out to get a jigsaw anywhere close to it, so I've used my multi tool. I've got a little bit of uh, making good to do on the actual edge, but it did a very good job. So we need shore power to do this oh, job? Oh, we need shore power. Right. Is... Okay. Now, we've got that hinge right the way across, just a couple of inches on either side. And up at the top, we've still got a gap, still a bit to put in, but uh, it's looking very useful. That will be fixed up there. So it'll look like that and then we'll get a catch. We haven't actually brought anything with us yet, but it will probably be something along the lines of what these are so we can get a finger in and give it a good pull 